Hi everyone, I'm Catherine and today I have a new video for you. Today I am actually going to do my weekly makeup basket and I'm a tad bit late with that uh, because I just was busy with um, university stuff so I just didn't get around to film this video yesterday. So I'm hoping I can edit this tonight and then upload it tomorrow which will be Tuesday. Um, we'll see. Ideally um, if I have enough time I would like to film another video as well right now and upload that um, this week too because um, I have a new project I would like to introduce you to. So, let me get right into it. Um, as always, I have um, a small and a big bin. The small bin contains um, eyelash curlers, then my perfume of the week. This is the um, Victoria's Secret Body Mist uh, Sex of the Things Noir. I, um, you'll see this again this week. Hopefully, like I said, hopefully I'll manage to film this again today. Um, then, pardon me. Two items I didn't want in there anymore. Then I have the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie in Hot Shots. This is a nice, slightly corally pink color. I decided to put in my Catrice Beautifying Lip Smoother in Apricot Cream again. It, pardon me, it is one of those, like the Clarence Instant Light Natural Lip Perfectors. Um, yeah, I just want to. I just decided to put that in again because on the go it's nice to use. Then I have um, my Revlon Color Burst Lip Butter in Peach Parfait. This is it. It's just a peachy pinky color. And then I have the uh, MAC Cream Sheen Lipstick in Everhip. Not sure if this is permanent. This is a quarterly color. I have this on my lips today. And finally, two mascaras, um, the Essence Color Flash um, Volume Mascara in the teal shade, still, still hoping to get going with that sometime. And um, a little Luxe Size sample for the um, Benefit Their Real Mascara. It has this plastic wand, I've used that today as well. Then, my, pardon me, I have my phone in there. Uh, then my big bin contains everything else. In it I have my a little palette. This is the um, NYX Bronze Smoky Look Kit. It has nine eyeshadows up here and then when you slide open the bottom you have two lip glosses. They're a bronzy shade and a pink shade. Um, not sure about the lip glosses to be honest but the eyeshadows are okay. Then I still have my little makeshift C palette. Oh, pardon me. I have a I think I have a brush here stuck to my nose. So I am still using my um, MAC copper plate then uh, MAC's brown down for whenever I want to use it and this is um, Laguna. This is a pressed pigment. I pressed that myself. It's from um, BEC. Then this one here is Catrice's Doll Eye Drama. This is another pre pigment I pressed myself, also from BC. This is PYT. It's a champagne color. And this over here is in here for the time being. Um, without me using it, it just fell out of the container it was in. And, um, and I decided to just work with it. And now it's stuck in here. This is technically a highlighter. It is a yellowy golden shade. Not sure. I can't see that. It is very subtle and I like that a lot. So I'll put that in here. Then I'm still working on my um, Beauty UK Baked Blush in 03 Halo. This is in my finished 4x4. Um, I'm, I just uploaded a, um, a progress report, so there you go. Um, then I have my Essence All About Matte Fixing Compact Powder. It's just a clear powder. Um, it leaves a little bit of a white cast if I'm not careful, but that's okay because usually I can work with it. And then I have the uh, MAC Mineralized Blush in Misbehave. This was part of a limited edition, as you can see. It has this nice cute little heart in there. It is incredibly pale, um, so even for me it is hard to work with, which is why I also have my um, Catrice Cream to Powder Blush in Coral all along. In here, I just use this underneath and then put the um, MAC Mineralized Blush over top. Then I decided to go back to my Physician's Formula Bronze Booster. This is a fair to light. There you go. 
this is it. It's a very nice shade. I like using that. Then next up, <coughs> pardon me. As usual, the um, Eucerin Sun Protection 50 Plus Sun Fluid for the for my face. It is mattifying. It's for sensitive skin. Yeah, yeah. You've probably heard it a, a thousand times before. And then I have um, Max. Pardon me, Max Floof in here. This is a frost finish, and I just used this as an inner corner highlight. I still have my MAC pigment. I believe this is um, purple or lilac. I still don't know. I think it's it's not the um, grape. It's not the grape pigment. Um, has a little bit of a blue glitter to it. I don't know, like sheen to it. Um, if you know what it is, please let me know. I would love to know. And then I, once again, my Overdue Mono Eyeshadow in Warm Vanilla. This is my brow highlight. I have my Catrice Concealer, my Camouflage Cream in 010 Ivory. Then another eyeshadow. This is the Catrice Vanilla Fair Velvet Matte Eyeshadow. I use this for all over the lid most of the time. It's just a cream shadow. It's not as pigmented as the Alberti one. Then... What else do we have here? <clears throat> um, my Catrice Eye Souffle Eyeshadow Souffle in Yes. This is dropping everything. Okay, and yes, I would. It's this um, creamy shade. I like this a lot. I have this on my lid today, but I put something over top. I still have my Mac Fluid Line in Dark Envy. It's just this dark green shade. I've used that today as well. I'm gonna see if I can zoom you in at the end of the video so you can take a quick look. Then I'm using my Misha Perfect Cover BB Cream in number 13. I like this. Um, I just need to be careful if I apply too much. It is not very easy to to smooth out. Um, yeah, my um, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind um, Eraser shade. What else do we have? Um, Benefit Stay Don't Stray. I don't use this as um, as an eyeshadow base. I use this as a concealer base for under my eyes. I'm gonna try this for that for the time being. For my eyeshadow, I'm using the um, Urban Decay eyesh Eyeshadow Primer Potion in Eden. It's just the um, that neutral shade. As a face primer, I'm using the Benefit Professional Deluxe Size Sample. I'm mixing in. This one here, Benefit Girl Meets Pearl, with my um, foundation. Um, when I when I have time to do my makeup, I'm going to use this. This is the Benefit Some Kind of Gorgeous um, foundation in medium. The thing is, I'm way way paler than medium, so I use this. I will use this as a bronzer if I use it. Then I have my Shiseido um, Dual Ended Eyeliner in Desert Dust, Desert Obscure. Um, as you can see, one side is lighter, the other side is a brown shade. The lighter shade I use for my um, for my waterline, and it's very nice for that. I'm still using my Essence um, Eyebrow Designer in Blonde, as well as my Anastasia Tinted Brow Gel in Blonde. Then, I did not yet take out my um, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. And I also kept um, the Clinique Quick Liner for Eyes in Roast Coffee. It's just a brown shade. It's one of those retractable pencils. And I'm trying to finish up these two here. These are both Manhattan Exact Eyeliners. They're supposed to be waterproof. One is obviously a teal shade. The other is black. Then I have um, Benefits Benetint. This is a lip and cheek stain. Um, I'm still trying to figure out how to use this on my cheeks. On my lips I've tried it. And it's a very nice shade. And finally, I still have in here my um, Lush Lip Service Lip Balm. I use this every morning before I do any of my makeup, before I even um, put on my moisturizer and my sunscreen because this is something that really moisturizes my lips so um, they don't crack as easily with the weather as it is right now. So this was it for the video for my makeup basket for the week. I wanted to zoom you in real quick. Let me see if I can do that. Now, as you can see, I have my cream and over top, my cream to powder blush. Over top, I use the MAC blush and a little bit of the um, highlighter. On my eyes, I used a few, the, yes, I would, eyeshadow souffle. Over top, I 
added a little bit of my highlighter shade because I like that as a um, lip color and in the crease I added copper plate along with um, with a warm tone from the NYX palette and in the outer V I added a little more of a darker shade. Eyebrows as usual, the um, Wait, let me zoom you in a little more. Mm. I added the um, the fluid line, the matte fluid line in Dark Enemy, and I tried to do a little wing. I'm horrible with um, winged eyeliner, so I never do it uh, very obvious. I just tried it every now and then because um, if I use darker color, especially with Dark Envy, I can make do. And it's not too obvious if I mess it up. On my lower lash line, I have the um, warm color I used to warm up copper plate. And I also have a little bit of the dark shade I used in my outer V. And the mascara is the um, Benefit The Real Mascara. And on my lips, like I said, the um, MAC Cream Sheen and Everhip. I added a little bit of the, um, the um, Marvelous Moxie um, in Hot Shot. And, um, but just to the center of my lip. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!